Hello and uh, welcome to free video tutorials. This is Emmanuel Mendu. In this video, we will see how to export grid view content to Word or Excel documents. For this, uh, I created a web website uh, project, and here we will add a new web form. Let's name this as grid view something and we need a grid view control and one button one button control let's name this as gd grid view to word same thing we'll name this as btn and we'll name we'll name the uh, give text to the button export to word okay so let's see how it uh, how it looks let's run and see how it looks so uh, okay i we just have a button we don't have any grid content so for that we will have a data table so here I added um, two columns to the data table and added few content to show on in the grid view. So let's run and see how it looks. So it looks a grid grid content and export. Let's have something different here. I will create a table for formatting the design. So let's put this grid in first tier. This way, this will go into the third, third row. And here we'll have a height. So let's see how it looks now. Now there is a space between uh, grid and exp button. That's good and just create a button event now let's go to design first we'll change a uh, little colorful we'll make the grid little colorful and click double click on the button stop this so it will create a event <coughs> button click event so let's save this in the button click event we have a small uh, steps to follow to bring uh, bring up the uh, grid view content to word so i will i'll show you that so here here is the code code like uh, we need we need to use a response um, clear and response buffer equal to true and add a header with a csv as common uh, comma separated values or we here we will we need to have a doc it's a doc so in the excel we will have a word so it will open the MR ms word application and uh, it will write we need a string writer and html text writer so we'll bind the grid and render that control so we already bind the grid so there is no need to bind again so let's see what it will show now so here is an exception for whenever you are rendering some control we it says uh, some like must be placed inside a form tag so we need a method to override this exception So I will uh, write a method to override this exception. So this is a method verify rendering in server form. So <coughs> this will this will override that uh, exception. So it won't give any exception again. So let's go ahead run run the uh, or website 
and we need to click we can click cover export to word and open it's uh, downloading so i think it's already it's opening trying to open but let's see so here is the word word document so it's already the grid content already came to here so okay, let's close this so now just want to get it in excel so we'll change this xls and the application is excel so let's go and click the same button let's say yes okay see this is excel this is that's it like how it's simple steps to get a content in our uh, word or excel um, <coughs> that's it uh, for the vi for this video uh, easy steps to get our content in our uh, exp um, word and excel thank you for watching uh, see you in the next video bye bye thank you